October 1st of 2022 is officially when we announce our companies are together. We had Part Auto on one side, Marketo on one side. We had to, at a minimum, pick up 90% of Marketo and get it in the HubSpot. Hi, my name is Emery Kalmaninsky. I'm the Senior Manager of Marketing Ops at Uber Freight. The acquisition created chaos, right? I mean, that's that's ultimately what acquisitions usually do. We were operating on similar-ish tech stacks, but ultimately they were very different. HubSpot became the only option. It was self-service. We could easily find more people that could operate in HubSpot. We could ramp people up very quickly into the platform. So ultimately it came down to HubSpot seems to be the best fit for us. And as part of the contract discussions with HubSpot, we said, who really knows HubSpot and who can really stand that up? We need somebody who can basically white glove this thing all the way through. Who can we partner with? We've got to have a partner. Hi, I'm Ryan Gunn, and I was the project lead on the Uber Freight project. We were able to instill confidence in Uber Freight by tapping into the institutional knowledge that Aptitude 8 has about HubSpot. We went with Aptitude 8 ultimately because of their capabilities. They had migrated numerous customers from Pardot and from Marketo, and that you know, gave us some confidence because we are bringing those two things together. We were bringing over a ton of automation from two different companies. Uber Freight acquired TransPlace and we were merging their systems into a single HubSpot instance. You're taking two very different types of business. How do we move the bulk of Marketo over in time for an October 1st launch? And then how do we finish that out and get the rest of those pieces in place? Ultimately a six month project that should have been really a year of a project for when you're talking about a double migration like that. Aptitude 8 as a company, I think, has more knowledge of the platform than any other company in the world, except for maybe HubSpot itself. So when we ran into a complex problem, we can go to our team and say, hey, we've got this problem that we need to solve. What are some different ways we can do it? Hi, my name is Travis McGinnis, and I'm a solution consultant on the Marketing Ops team with Aptitude 8. One of the biggest challenges we're up against with this migration was getting the differences between Marketo and HubSpot to sync fluidly without losing any core functionality between the two systems. So we had to get creative in making it work so it wouldn't lose that key result, get lost in translation basically. Bringing us on was a way that they could get all of that automation implemented while they were getting up to speed. All of those complex workflows, lists, and automations that we pulled from Marketo into HubSpot, they work. Nobody on either of their teams was familiar with HubSpot, so they would not have been able to build all of this stuff on their own without a significant amount of troubleshooting, trial and error, really completely learning a new system. I had confidence in Aptitude 8. They had done their research, and this is what we needed. And that took a huge amount of stress off of me personally, uh, just from a project management standpoint. I didn't have to worry, okay, well, I've got to go learn a new system, learn all these new pieces. Aptitude 8's got it. I love HubSpot. I think what they've built is top notch. I mean, it really is. It's a really great platform. But what they've built is something that pretty much anyone can use. And for us, with such a small team uh, for marketing, that's key. So getting Uber Freight out of Marketo, which was hard to use, clunky, janky, and into HubSpot, which is easy to use, intuitive, and clean, I think that was one of the biggest wins, in my opinion, for their team. You know, personally, I mean, I felt great just at the overall partnership. Less stress on me, made me a lot happier, made it a lot easier to report out to other stakeholders what was happening. They were always pleasant. They were always engaging. Um, tell that they knew their stuff. Moving this size company, Uber Freight, which is massive, they're a global organization, over to HubSpot from Marketo in six months, that's a Herculean feat right there. But we did it. Proud of the work we did. Like we did a massive amount of work in a short period of time and probably saved Uber Freight years worth of stress and migration issues and difficulties that we just took care of for them, just took a weight off their shoulders basically and said, here, Aptitude, you take this from us, you do it, and we'll help you along the way, but just get it done for us. If you're looking for somebody to partner with, first and foremost, who's got the skill set? And then second, can they meet your timeline? If they've got the skills, or you've got the budget for it, and they've got the people that can ramp up and execute against it, you know, to me, that's the immediate fit. And having that partner that we can trust for those things really went a long ways in this entire project. 